Hi dear friends, good morning all of you. Uh, class 4 is science. We were discussing the second chapter and although we have completed uh, five videos of the second chapter, keeping healthy. Okay, and this is the sixth video of the same chapter and in this video we will complete this chapter and uh, only a little bit uh, remaining, 10% um, of the chapter is remaining, almost 90% is completed and uh, today we are will discuss the uh, uh, preventing breeding of mosquitoes and of flies then second one vaccination and the last one keeping healthy and fit okay so while these three after discussing these three topics we will complete the second chapter okay and uh, i just wanted to tell you that uh, although it is very noisy here um, hawa and uh, uh, this is very difficult to it may be very difficult to hear um, what I am taking, uh, what I am going to uh, this one teach you today. So please kindly wear a uh, earphones. Okay. So it will be, it would be help you to uh, understand. It will be easy to hear what all things which I am going to tell today. Okay. So uh, we were discussing about uh, how can we prevent the communicable diseases, and uh, uh, we were discussed already sunlight with the help of sunlight and heat we can prevent the communicable disease. And uh, uh, last video we discussed that also. And one more. Uh, clean water and food, uh, if the water and food is contaminated, that is very, uh, this one, we, we cannot take uh, uh, such a type of food and water, so it way, uh, this one gives us different types of diseases, okay, so we were discussing about that one, how we must be safe, how can be safe about uh, uh, this one, different types of communicable diseases, two topics we already discussed, and today we are discussing this one, preventing uh, breeding of mosquitoes and uh, Flies, then vaccination, then again, how can we this one, uh, this one, keep you healthy and fit? If you are uh, this one, uh, healthy, if you are fit, uh, then what happens? You are always this one, far away from different types of diseases. Okay, so that is about that one. So moving on to the uh, topic, first one, preventing uh, of uh, preventing breeding of mosquitoes and flies. And you know that the mosquitoes are and the flies are very dangerous. They can easily give you different types of Communicable diseases, okay. Communicable diseases like uh, uh, different uh, types of communicable disease also we were discussed already. Uh, so uh, like uh, flu, cold, and uh, TB. Then again, next one, uh, this one, uh, uh, this one. Some uh, uh, anopheles mosquito we were discussing through animals. Different types of diseases may come to you. That is a uh, uh, malaria, uh, this one, uh, etc., etc. It may reach you. It may comes to your body. Then you will be called sick. So, main important thing is uh, mosquitoes and uh, flies. These two things, they are always ready to spread uh, uh, these types of diseases. So, what you have to do, some safety measures are already we are given there in the textbook. We are going to discuss that one. Mosquitoes, page number 19, textbook page number 19. Uh, mosquitoes breed or lay their eggs. They used to put their eggs in a stand in the water. So, where the water is, uh, this one stands there. If water is not floating, so flowing so what happens uh, this one uh, the mosquitoes will come and uh, lay their eggs there so, so where the, if the water is moving they cannot put their they cannot lay their eggs if the water is stable if the water is always uh, standing for a particular time in the such a type of places the mosquitoes may come and lay their eggs there so in stage in the water the mosquitoes do uh, this one put their eggs so we must uh, Avoid, okay, we must see, if you see that uh, in some places, like uh, in our garden there will be, uh, this one, uh, uh, flower pots will be there, or bottles cap, so in these places water can collect and it may, uh, this one stay in there. So in such type of places, these mosquitoes, they easily lay their eggs. So what you have to do, there are some steps are there, first one, keep water tanks covered, so in such a situation, you just have to So that is the first step you have to do. Likewise, we can prevent the breeding of this one, mosquitoes. Okay, so moving to the first step, keep water tanks covered wherever uh, in your house there will be water tanks. So you will always collect and hold water with that water tanks. Okay, so keep always a lid over it there must be a uh, this one lid it will be available when you purchase this one so always keep water tanks uh, covered okay then second one do not let water to collect in uh, dishes uh, then again drainages ports vessels and uh, coolers etc etc so always check these places okay and if water is there you just uh, 
clear that water, remove, try to remove that water from there, and it will be preventing the spreading of mosquitoes. Okay. Again, next one, repair or prevent water leaks from taps and air conditions or coolers. These are all the places where water can collect land or hold up. Okay. So, there uh, we should note uh, this one, uh, allow this water to uh, this one, uh, collect and it should not be there in those type of places. Okay. Then again, next one, wear full sleeved shirts and uh, this one, uh, trousers, etc. So, uh, in the evening time when you are sitting, when you are walking, you try to wear or in the in your house also when you are sitting, you know, that time you must wear uh, this one, full sleeve shirts or full sleeve t-shirts, etc, etc, which will help you, uh, this one, uh, biting uh, from mosquitoes, etc, etc. Okay, so try to wear such a type of dresses and likewise you will not get the different types of communicable diseases. Again, next one, make sure the drains and stairs are clean and if you see them choke, inform your eldest. Okay, if you see blockages there, you just uh, inform your eldest parents, uh, with some brother, etc, etc, so uncle, auntie that is, uh, there is block, it is blocked there, please uh, uh, remove that, don't allow uh, water to stand there, if water is there, there must be uh, this one, mosquitoes, breeding of mosquitoes, mosquitoes, apna, jaga. so that would be a uh, diff difficult situation, okay, so the simple thing you can do, what is the, uh, if you see that if a lot of water is there in, a, in some places, then we cannot uh, just remove that water from some uh, places. Okay, so what you have to do, if you have kerosene, you just uh, pour uh, this one, uh, cap, a cap of kerosene you put over that one. So that kerosene will make a top layer of that uh, water. So the mosquitoes, the already larva which is present inside that water, it will die. They will not get a enough amount of oxygen. So likewise, sir, you can kill these type of mosquitoes also. So please keep that in mind also. And last one, ask the elders to get your house and neighborhood fumigated or sprayed with the insecticide regularly. Those are these things already doing here also. So please don't be uh, if it is not regularly, apna municipality or apna panchayat kya nahi karta hai. They are not spraying insecticides or something like that. So just to make sure that uh, they are coming and uh, spraying this or these things. Okay. So in public places, likewise only we can do this one uh, removing this. Uh, how the likewise we can prevent the breeding of mosquitoes. Also, uh, just to keep that also in your mind. Okay. So if public places are uh, this one dirty or like that, it is. You just to inform the authorities that to clear such a type of places. Okay. So that is about that one. Flies breed in dirt and garbage. Uh, in some places there will be garbage to throw the waste. Okay. So garbage is the downside portion will be closed. So even when the time of rain, by shayega, uska andar pani kya it will be there. So that is also one of the important place for these mosquitoes and flies to put their eggs to lay their eggs. So in such a type of places also, we must be careful. Okay, uh, check that uh, or inform the authorities that uh, take or collect the uh, this one garbage regularly. So likewise, we can clear uh, this one. So likewise, we can prevent the breeding of this type of mosquitoes. Okay, so we must uh, clean hygiene ourselves. Our body must be clean, and at the same time, our surroundings, uh, uh, everything must be clean. Then we won't be getting any. Uh, different types of communicable diseases. Okay. Then again, next one that is a uh, vaccination. Vaccination means uh, simple thing that is you may know that uh, in the uh, this one. Uh, small times aplo bacha hai tab apna mabam me aapko polio dene ke liye leke jayega so polio is the uh, like waise vaccines are available vaccine is the act of injecting a person which is a, uh, with a vaccine to protect him or her with the uh, from uh, her, from her or him or her whoever ladka ladki hai usko vaccine dega usko so kya hai bachayenge different types of diseases also polio vaccine we are we are taking polio vaccine to prevent the this one polio disease prevent from polio disease so likewise vaccines are available for uh, different uh, diseases such as polio cholera typhoid jaundice measles and uh, meningitis etc etc so uh, uh, this one try to take the vac those vaccines so if you take vaccines then if you, when you go to hospital if you have these symptoms the doctors will automatically give, will give you that uh, different types of uh, different uh, which is needed for that uh, disease the vaccine will be provided by the doctor itself. So please don't worry about that one and try to take vaccine. If the doctor tell you that to take vaccine, you don't reject it. Okay. So that is the best thing. You don't try to reject it. We don't vaccine. Just to take the vaccine. Vaccine will help us to 
uh, this one getting different types of uh, the diseases communicable diseases like this one cholera typhoid etc jaundice etc etc okay so that is about that one vaccine vaccine will help us to this stay healthy and it will not allow that uh, different types of allow uh, different types of diseases to come over body if you take uh, this one vaccine against the cholera cholera will not come to you okay it will not uh, this will come to your body so likewise we must be always careful again next one the last topic keep be healthy and uh, fit last topic that is uh, now already we discussed uh, we must uh, take different types of Full uh, balanced diet we already discussed in the chapter. So we must be keep uh, this one healthy and like if we must be healthy and uh, fit always. Okay, after our body acha rehne ke liye, hamlo exercise karna hai, acha khana khana hai, balanced diet karna hai, exercise karna hai, door na hai, exercise na. Already we discussed and you know that. Okay, then also last in page number twenty some important things are given there. How we must be. And this will keep our body healthy, etc. etc. I'll just to tell that uh, first one eat a balanced diet, uh, uh, sub cheese khana hai, hai? Uh, If you don't like uh, some uh, food, uh, you don't, uh, don't try to eat like this. Uh, हम लोग को कोई कोई खाना पसंद नहीं है लाइक परवर एक्सरसाइज होता करेला कोई नहीं खाता है करेला इज वेरी गुड वेजिटेबल एंड सम पीपल डू नॉट लाइक दैट ओके सो प्लीज इफ यू डोंट लाइक आल्सो अपना मामा मम्मी बना के दिया तो यू जस्ट ईट दैट बी मस्ट गिव अ बैलेंस्ड डाइट बिकॉज़ द फूड व्हिच यू डोंट लाइक व्हिच कंटेन स्मॉल अमाउंट ऑफ न्यूट्रिएंट्स एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा ओके सो प्लीज कीप अ बैलेंस्ड डाइट वी मस्ट ईट ऑल टाइप्स ऑफ वेजिटेबल्स ऑल टाइप्स ऑफ फ्लैश एंड मीट एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा all types of vegetables all these things so we must have in our daily life okay and again second one choose food that is rich, rich in raw fish i told you what is raw fish also i explained in the part two okay so please check that what is raw fish there and eat food items which are made from whole grains at all etc etc you must eat okay whole grains you must you must take okay then again is to blend your fruits and vegetables they protect you from different types of a disease is already we discussed that then again exercise regularly sub din exercise kar dijiye body fit rahega acha rahega muscles will be strong okay then again last one get enough rest and sleep well okay sleeping is also one more important thing to fit healthy acha se sona hai se 6 se 8 ghanta tak ek din mein sona hai you must take a sleep apna body ko rest milega tabhi na agla din acha se apna sharir acha se काम करेगा सो ईट वेल स्लीप वेल ओके टेक रेस्ट आल्सो एंड इट विल हेल्प आवर बॉडी आवर बॉडी विल गेट इन अ टाइम टू रिपेयर आल्सो ओके सो दैट इज अबाउट रिपेयर एंड मेंटेनेंस ऑफ योर बॉडी ठीक नहीं है इफ यू हैव फीवर यू मस्ट टेक रेस्ट ठीक है आफ्टर टेकिंग 2 3 डेज ऑफ रेस्ट योर बॉडी हैज टू बी रीगेन्ड ओके सो सच थिंग्स वी मस्ट डू द लास्ट वन कीप योर सराउंडिंग्स क्लीन अपना सराउंडिंग्स घर का घर का जो प्लेस में दिस वन टॉयलेट दिस वन एंड द किचन साइड आल्सो ऑलवेज मस्ट बी क्लीन ओके एंड इन द नेबरहुड इन द सराउंडिंग्स सो फैक्स द एवरीथिंग मस्ट बी एवरी प्लेस मस्ट बी नीट एंड क्लीन सो दिस ऑल दिस थिंग विल हेल्प यू टू स्टे दिस वन हेल्दी कीप फिट एक्सेट्रा सो ऑलवेज कीप ऑल दिस थिंग इन माइंड एंड व्हाट ऑल थिंग्स वी हैव स्टडीड इन दिस चैप्टर दैट आल्सो always keep in your mind and just please try to do the objectives which is given in page number uh, 21 and uh, i'll give you question and question and answer as a small pdf like the first chapter so please stay at home safe at home uh, study well and always be happy thank you all of you god bless you.